Where wilt thou lead me? Speak. I'll go no further. Mark me. I will. My hour is almost come, when I to sulfurous and tormenting flames must render up myself. Alas, poor ghost. Pity me not, but lend thy serious hearing to what I shall unfold. I am bound to hear. So art thou to revenge when thou shalt hear. What? I am thine father's spirit, doomed for a certain term to walk the night, and for the day confined fast and quiet, till the foul crime done in my day of nature are burnt and purged away. But that I am forbid to tell the secrets of my prison house, I could a tale unfold whose lightest word will harrow upon thine soul, freeze thy young blood, make thine two eyes like stars start from the spheres. They not to combine locks to part, and each particular head stand on end like quizzle upon a fretful porcupine. But this eternal blazing must not be. To the ears of flesh and blood, list, list, oh list, if thou didst ever thine father's love. O oh God! Revenge is foul and most unnatural murder. Murder? Murder most foul, it's in the best it is. But this most foul, strange, and unnatural. Haste me to naught, that I, with wings as swift as meditation, or with thoughts of love, may sweep to my revenge. I find thee apt, and duller shalt thou be than thine fat weed, that roots itself in ease on the leathered wharf. Would thou not stir in this, now Hamlet, here? Tis given out that, sleeping in mine orchard, a serpent stung me, so that the whole ear of Denmark is by a forged process of my death, rankly abused, but no, thou noble youth, that the serpent did not sting thy father's life, now wears his crown. O oh, prophetic soul, my uncle! I, the insidious and agile beast, which with craft of his wit, and with traitorous gifts, O oh, wicked wit, and guess that have the powers so to seduce one his shameful lust that will of my most seeming virtuous queen o oh, hamlet what falling off was there from me whose love was of that dignity that it went hand in hand even with the vows i made to her in marriage and declined upon the wretch whose natural gifts were poor to those of mine but virtue as it never will be moved through lewdness caught, and in the shape of heaven, so lust through a radiant angel late, will saint itself in celestial bed and prey on garbage. But soft, methinks, I sent the morning air, brief let me be, sleeping within my orchard, my custom is always of the afternoon, upon my secure hour, thine uncle stole with the juice of cursed henambow in a vial, and with the processes of my ears did pour the Letrous discernment, whose effects hold such an entity with the blood of man, that swift as quicksilver it courses through the natural gates and alleys of the body, and with the sun vigor dog possess, and curb like egos droppings in the milk, the thin and wholesome blood, so did it mine, and in a most instant terror, barked about, a most laser-like, with vile loosened crust, all my smooth body. Thus was I sleeping by a brother's hand, by life a crown of queen, and at once dispatched, cut off even in the blossoms of my sin, unhoused, disappointed, unnounced, no reckoning made, but sent to my account, with all my imperfections on my head. Oh, horrible, oh, horrible, most horrible. If thou hast nature in thee, bear it not. Let not the royal bed of Denmark be a couch for luxury and damned incest. Take not thy mind, nor let thy soul contrive against thy mother ox. Leave her to heaven, and those thorns in which her bosom lodged, the prick and sting her. Fare thee well at once, the glow-worm show the mason to be near, and gin the pale's unaffectual fire. Adieu, adieu, Hamlet, remember me. O oh, all of you hosts of heaven, O oh, earth, what else? And shall I couple hell? Fie, hold my heart. And you, my sinew, grow not instant old. I, thou poor ghost, while memory holds a seat in this distract globe, remember thee, yea, for the table of memories, all solved book, all form, all pressure past, 
that young but observation copy there, and thy commandments all alone shall live. Within the book and volumes of my brain, unmixed with, with that of matter, yes, but heaven, O oh, most virtuous woman, O oh, villain, villain, smiling, damn the villain, my table meet, it is set, it is I set it down, that O oh, one of my smile, and a smile, and be a villain, at least I am sure, it may be so in Denmark. So, uncle,